Welcome back to the channel. We're gonna be looking at Blazing Banana Spray Wax from the Chemical Guys today. I'm gonna do a review, but I'm also gonna do a demo and show you how to apply it. We're also gonna do a comparison of what the surface is like with it applied and without it applied. And we'll do a side by side so you can get a really good idea of how well this product works um, and if it's the right thing for you. Let's get started. First of all, let's talk about what is Blazing Banana Spray Wax. Well, obviously it is a spray wax. It is a carnauba wax, so it's all natural, not the synthetic wax. Um, some of the claims it has that it will be high gloss, um, quick shine, enhancing the depth and reflection, um, giving a mirror finish on any kind of colors. Um, and then it's, it's just quick. It says that it contains optical brighteners. Um, we'll get a look at that today. I have a white car. This would obviously be better done on something like a red car, but I don't have a red car. It's a white car. So um, if we can see that it has visibly brightened it, then we'll know that it's definitely working. You can see I got this thing split in half. We're gonna do over here, we're gonna do the spray wax. Over here, we're just gonna have it as kind of our control to show you what it is without the wax. So I'm gonna get spraying. All right, we'll give it a shake first. Give you a quick note here. This nozzle does do a stream or a spray pattern. Um, it's not real specific there. The stream is just like you would think it would be. It's a nice, fine stream. The spray is actually a mist. So if you got a big area to do, you're gonna wanna probably just use the mist. If you have a small piece of paneling that you don't want to have much overspray, you can use the stream. So I want to make sure that it is on spray. And we'll get going. And we just kind of spread it out over the surface. No need to rub it in hardcore. Flip it over to the clean side and give it a quick buff and you'll notice it start kind of drying and you can really feel that towel sliding across it pretty easily. So I haven't even put any water on this to test how well it beads up, but I can already see how much brighter it is. Like the reflection is just a lot more rich even in this white paint. Quick side note, this stuff smells incredible. They call it blazing bananas because it's slick as bananas, but it also actually smells like bananas. Here's the first test. I have a small bucket full of water here. I'm gonna put it on both sides and see how it slides. This is the wax side. Oh, got it. <laughs> Catch that. And then on the side without the wax, it just sits there. But now let's pour some of that water on there and see how well it beads. This is the banana wax side. You can see it. It evacuates pretty quickly and beats up. This is the non-waxed side. It still evacuates because it is on a slope here, but the water is kind of, um, it's staying there. Like it takes a little while for it to actually bead up. At first look at this side, and this side seemed to be beading kind of the same, but when I run my hands over this, it's pretty much completely dry. On this side, even though it looks like it's beaded up, it's, it's still wet. There's a layer of water all the way across it still, um, as opposed to the other side, it's pretty much completely dry. Why does the beading matter? Well, the side without the banana wax, it beat it up, but it still left a little film of water on the surface. The banana wax side beat it up, the water escaped and then it was pretty much dry right away. So when you're driving down the road and your car gets wet, what's gonna happen is all that dirt and road grime is gonna stick to the water, dry on the car and build up that dirty film, making it look dull. Banana wax side, it's already dry. The, the dirt and road dust is going to blow off of the car, keeping your car shinier for longer. And the next time you have to go wash it, it's gonna wash a lot easier. So can you tell the difference in the shine? It's a little hard to show it on the camera, but I can definitely see the reflections of the trees and the clouds uh, being brighter and sharper on the side that has the wax. 
Some quick final thoughts about the Blazing Banana Spray Wax from the Chemical Guys. I think it delivered on all of its promises. It left the high gloss shine. It enhanced the depth and the reflection, left that mirror finish. Um, if I had a really colorful car, I think it would enhance the color because it definitely made this white just look brighter. Um, but most of all, and the reason that I think that you're gonna wanna buy this is that it is quick, it's easy. I spend a bunch of time washing my car. I don't wanna spend a bunch of time waxing it. So I can do this entire car in 15 to 20 minutes and it looks amazing. Um, another product from the Chemical Guys you might wanna check out that goes along with this is their Extreme Body Wash and Wax. Uh, so check out the video I have up here um, about that. Hopefully this was helpful for you. Um, if it was, please consider subscribing to this channel. I'm always bringing out new content. Until next time, have a good one.